We often get asked about the use of storytelling and the way that you can use it to influence. Now remember, influencing is the ability to change the way someone thinks, feels and behaves. And storytelling is one of the most important tools you can use in this regard. Welcome to the Colin James Methodology and in this short analysis of business storytelling we'll share with you what the three keys are based on our analysis over the years of research we've done into this. Any website you go to, one of the things you'll notice on websites that are selling or positioning something that they'll have testimonials. What are testimonials? Well, testimonials in themselves are a small story. They have the story of somebody describing their experience of the product or service that was on offering. Now, one of the things about the testimonial, not only is there a memorable or supportive quote, there's the name of the person and their title and their uh, organization that they come from. Now, inherent and just in a testimonial are already some of the keys that we are talking about. So when you are using a story, here are the three keys. First, be clear on the purpose of the story and its relationship to your narrative. In other words, what's the point of the story? Is it to convince? In other words, you want to provide some verification or some proof that your product and service already has reach. So you draw upon a story of a satisfied customer. Is it to overcome resistance and objections? In other words, you tell a story of where someone was in a similar position than the person that you're telling the story to. They can see themselves in that situation. And as a result of learning from the behavior of, the story, of what occurred in the story, they can see themselves applying a similar practice. It's a way of embedding instruction or what we call embedded commands, but using story as a way of doing it. And thirdly, uh, another aspect of why you would use story is that it's a way of demonstrating your own, uh, your own credibility because the story of your past achievements or a story around an accomplishment, not done in a grandiose way, but in a way of illustrating that you know what you're talking about. And there are many others, but those are normally the top three.